Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to week five of the spring season of the weekend series. And this week I'm gonna be doing things a little bit differently. Uh, I've had a few requests in the comments from people saying I should play more than just duels. And um, yeah, sure, why not? Uh, so what I'm gonna be doing today is I'll be playing probably two of each type of game. And I know that I haven't uh, finished the rest of my games, but I'm a little bit behind and I'm probably gonna do the rest of them later on um, and I might not feel like recording then so I'm just gonna record now so I'll play until I have 7 out of 10 done and then I can let you guys know in the comments how uh, the final games went for each mode but uh, yeah I'm gonna jump into these games now I'll try Battle Royale Distance first because uh, why not and so far I've gotten uh, one 5 out of 5 of these modes and then kinda choked twice in the countries um, I've gotten uh, first three times and second twice. So here we go for distance. Do not recognize anybody in this lobby, which is probably a good thing, at least for the uh, purposes of <clears throat> keeping my record good. Uh, so this looks, this is Southern Africa. Looks to just be South Africa, I think. And in the early rounds of uh, distance, just that is probably enough to get me through to the next round, but may as well look around a little bit more. There's not a whole lot going on here, so I will just drop it uh, right there. And uh, yeah, like a lot of these lower level players just are not very good, um, so. It's not usually very hard to beat them. Because they guess pretty far away from the correct spot, oftentimes. And we were... Okay, he went for Lesotho, but he was pretty close. But, uh, yeah, only, what, three people even guessed in the correct country there. And then there were people all over the place. <clears throat> so that's kind of how these early distance rounds go. Part of the reason why I didn't record distance... Uh, before is just because, well, some of the rounds are not all that interesting, but to be fair, it can get quite stressful at the end. So I'm going this way because I saw the back of this sign and I want to see the front of it. What? Prelog? What the heck does that mean? Okay. Oh no. Is that a better sign? I can't tell. Anyway, the bollards are like probably Hungarian, maybe Croatian, I'm not entirely sure, but do we have an antenna here? Do we not? Hold on, I'm going to guess Hungary and see how far away I am. Okay, that's solid. It's not amazing, though. I should be fine. Is, is it ever like Serbia or North Macedonia? Because I didn't see an antenna. No, never mind. It is Croatia. Okay, fair enough. Uh, okay, cool. But I only used one guest there, so I still have the maximum three, so nothing to worry about, really. Squad Opawowi. Okay, so Polish. I do not have much beyond that, but let's see if we can find something. Poland is often a tricky one when you don't have information to try and figure out the region. I don't think those are area codes, nor is that. Can I even remember the area codes? So all of, more towns end in all of in, I think, the southern half of the country. So I will go southern-ish for now. Could be doing a lot better than that. Ostrovets. Oh no. Um, should be safe, although certainly could have done a little bit better with this. Okay, well it was more just closer to Warsaw. That's why people were um, getting quite close there, but not a problem. Again, usually, if you've got the country, usually you don't have much to worry about with these uh, distance rounds. 
in the first like half of the game and then it gets intense so this is Hungary I don't oh oh my god 2225 I've been I've been uh, researching area codes or postal codes because of uh, the French cup now two the twos are like around Budapest um, but not like in it but Ulo well I don't know exactly I don't know specifically where like two two is so I'll go a little bit south of Budapest and see where that gets me. I guess I can just look for Ulo. Although it's probably unlikely that I come across it. Uh, whatever. <clears throat> We're good enough here. And we have... Okay, it was closer to the city. Ulo, yeah, it's there, but it's quite tiny. All right. Next up, how about, okay, Czechia, one, so Brno there, Koyatin, I don't know what Koyatin is, but we're moving west, so Koyatin is there, so could we just be here at that exit, or... Is it seven miles or kilometers to the exit? I'm not sure. Um, 367. That's this here. So, okay. So we'd be somewhere along here. Kind of just before this big curve here. So, yeah, this kind of, this kind of thing here roughly. Obviously this will be close enough to advance me. 155 meters, that is a 5k on a world map. So we take that. Love to see it. Now what is this? Pharaohs maybe? Possibly Iceland? Don't know. Pharaohs it is, so... hmm. Trollones, okay. We have water to the north. Trollones. Hmm, okay. Yeah, not so sure about this. There's a fair few places in the Faroe Islands where you have water to the north, but maybe the town will be marked. Then again. Maybe it will not. Okay, well, we'll try there. I'm closest, so that's probably good enough. Although I would... What I saw might not be the town name, because I don't see it here. But we'll see where it is. It's quite close to where I put it. And it was the town name, but it's so small that it just wasn't going to show up. Okay, four left. Uh, is that Albania? But the red is on the right, so that's kind of weird. Let's keep going here. Okay, not Albania. Croatia, rather, I think. I would... I would hope. And the landscape certainly makes sense, although that's not a Croatian plate. Neither is it. Oh, is it Montenegro? Oh, it's Montenegro, isn't it? I thought that cross D was a Croatian thing, but apparently it exists in both. Um, feels kind of coastal. Let's go, like, around here. Okay, probably shouldn't have guessed in the water. I'm not going to get points for uh, correct country if I do that, so probably guess again. If you go down the coast. Yep, that was the right thing to do, it seems. And it was further down the coast, but solid guess anyway. And what do we have now? Switzerland or something? Hard to tell. It is Switzerland. Um, Gosso? Or no, 
Gossau. Thought it was French. It was not. Uh, I don't know area codes or anything. So we have Gossau. We have Gr Gruningen. Okay. Obviously never heard of these places, which worries me a little bit. Okay, can I go to the signs, please? Really? Okay, so Zurich. Oh my god, we're getting close to the end here. So, Gruningen. Um, can I find these places? Go south. We're over here then. Oh, maybe not. I wasn't closer, but I, I'm fine anyway. Okay, we weren't actually very close to Gosau. Okay, sure. I thought we would be, since it seems to be a pretty small town, but... Whatever. Uh, so, final round. We each have three guesses here, and... I cannot read that. I still can't read it. Huh, okay. Sounds French. Although these bollards are weird. Although they may be like old French bollards. Or it might not be French at all. I. What the heck does that say? No, I gotta keep going. Is this ever Germany? I'm. I'm getting worried here. You are kidding me. I need one piece of language here. I think it's France, but I don't know. I'm confused. Or maybe it's oh, maybe oh, it's Lux, isn't it? I saw a yellow plate. I think it's Lux. I completely forgot about Luxembourg. Okay, uh, we'll go over here. I think I'm fine, but okay, I I should be good. Yeah. Okay, that was stupid of me to forget that Luxembourg existed. It made sense with the Gen two and that yellow plate. I kind of assumed that it was an old French plate, but. Yeah, makes sense it was just Luxembourg. Anyway, got away with it. Play a country game now. Should be, well, okay, I've lost two of these so far, so you never know, but <clears throat> I think I should be able to do this. Okay, it's kind of crap, but with um, movement-wise, but I think it's Norway. I'm guessing a lot of people are going to guess US here, which it definitely is not. Oh, never mind. Okay, they were they were good enough to guess uh, Nordic. I think I thought maybe the white line or the yellow center line would fool people, but to be fair, the landscape is quite European. All right, I could ooh, I should oh, I could have Chad moved there. That's my bad. I should have done that because that definitely the lower level players that definitely gets them. If I'd guess Svalbard first, that uh, that would have fooled a few, I think. That's a missed opportunity, but uh, uh, what can I say? I'm too kind-hearted. I often uh, I forget about the Chad move, <clears throat> but it is a useful tool on occasion. Okay, Australia, by the looks of it. A hundred percent, yeah. With the bollards driving left, looks like a New South Wales plate. And it even says Australia on that bus. But we're still going to lose a couple people. Well, one person, probably. And yeah, these early country rounds can be slow too because some people just aren't as good at um, figuring it out. But that was pretty quick. What do we have here? Looks very US like. Very much so. If not, it would be Canada, but I think it's US. And I think everyone else is going to guess US, so I may as well do the same. And it is New Jersey. Okay. Fair enough. On we go. I don't know what this is. Okay, I still don't know what this is. Holy moly, this could be a tough one. Especially with this movement. No way they get this. OK, 
Okay, guesses of Russia, Estonia, and Greece. I was thinking more maybe Central Europe, like Slovakia or Czechia or something. But, to be quite honest, I don't have any real clue, so... Okay, another person guessed Russia for some reason. Is that... Ooh. Oh my god, somebody got it. Oh, he guessed Czechia and then immediately got it right, so I'm guessing that means we are in Slovakia. Yes, it does. Okay, and we're very close to Austria. So yeah, that was kind of my first instinct, but I wanted to wait and see. I think we'll definitely lose a few more people here. Or they'll use their 50-50 and maybe miss it anyway. George got it. Will Lilianto get it? Yes. Will Dionysoj get it? Yeah, okay. They're getting the 50s right. <clears throat> and then this dude here is just not going to guess or something. There we go, 50. Do you have time? You did, but you got it wrong. Next. Indo? Gotta be Indo, yeah. Not much of a problem here. One person went Malaysia. Careful. <clears throat> Four to go. This is... Oh, no. Where in Southern Europe are we? Can I get... Uh, Oh, crap. Greece, maybe? I'll try Greece. I've got multiple guesses anyway. Next, maybe Italy. Oh, my... Wow, really? Oh, my goodness. How did they all get that? Okay. I don't know if there was something I didn't see there, but... Uh, just, oh, no. What is this, U.S.? I think it is, you know. Where is this? I don't know. We won't find out. Utcha, that is Hungarian for street or road. That's a <clears throat> good giveaway for Hungary. Hopefully we lose someone here, but these players seem to be fairly good. Okay. Lost one. Final and we're... Is this a trekker, really? God, it is a trekker. I'm gonna fifty. The, I'm gonna fifty fifty this because this is stupid. Uh, it's German. I'm still gonna fifty it. Okay, I'm pretty sure that language was German. Okay, well, good job. Well done. I can't look at the location. That's wow. Did I really mistake German for Danish? That's really bad. I didn't look at it long enough. I thought, it, uh, that's so stupid. That's my bad. I should never, ever be doing that. They're they're reasonably similar, but they're not similar enough to where I should be mistaking them. Um, I didn't look at the sign long enough. I just thought the words that I saw looked German. And that, yeah, that was an error. So I have lost three country battle royale games this weekend, which is just uh, way too many. Because <clears throat> it's usually a mode that I don't really lose often in. So yeah, kind of bad. Um, anyway, dual time, Guatemala, don't care where. I also didn't see my opponent's rating, let me check that. 803, okay. So a solid player, but not a great one. Should be beatable. I hope so, otherwise I'm gonna lose like 30 elo. Okay, <clears throat> good start. Did not know the Guatemala meta. Okay, we have Latin America again, by the looks of it. This time Gen 4 could be Mexico. Definitely feeling... Mexico, yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to go with the undefeated Mexico City hedge, because I swear literally every time it is in or near Mexico City. Or certainly every time I don't go there, it ends up being there, so... That is definitely what I'm going to do. See if it pays off. Yep. Very often does. Round three. 
Hmm. Cyrillic? Yes. Zapchastu. I don't know what that means. Oh my god. Penzenskoye Oblasti. What is Penzenskoye? Is that Penza? Is in Penza, Russia, which is here, or are we in Ukraine? No, we're in Russia. Okay, I'm going Penza then. <laughs> oh, let's go. That's huge. The one time when it pays off to know the Russian federal subjects, I have memorized all of them. I know every single one, but so rarely in Russia do you see the name of a federal subject. So very often it just is useless. But I'm so glad I actually got to use that. That was that was really fun. Oh, I actually didn't mean to jump into another duel, but that's okay. I was going to play two of each, so this can just be my second duel. <clears throat> and here we have a low-ranked player. Shouldn't be a problem. can't believe I've lost three country games. What the heck am I doing? Uh, what is this? Bulgaria? Oh my. That quickly changed. I could just use... Bit of language, please. It's probably Bulgaria, realistically. Ooh, water. Okay. Cyrillic. Yes, indeed. Dot BG. So that would put us, I don't know, up here maybe. I mean, with the water, I would assume we'd be somewhere around. Oh my god, what a guess. Even then, it could have been anywhere along this coast, so that's a pretty insane guess. Love to see it. Um, Cambodia, I think. Unless I'm dumb. Uh, I think it is Cambodia. And it should be the capital. It feels large. I don't know, though. See if that works. A oh. Oh, wow, how about that? It was Preasianuk. I've never seen... I didn't even know there was coverage there. I don't think I've ever seen a location there. Pretty cool. Okay. Very quick game there. Got the little gold trophy for duels for the 70 points. And let's play a couple more Battle Royales. All right. Yeah, so... Took a loss, but really second place isn't... Isn't going to kill you. It's really not so bad. All right, let's go. Finland. Anything on here? No. Nothing much, at least. How about this one? Oh, how about that? Very blurred, but I see Vascula, which is here, and then... Let's see. Ugh. E43, I think I see 24 and 9, and it's E63, rather. 63, 63, 23, hmm, 9, Quopio? Maybe we're here. No, we're not. Okay. Shouldn't be a problem. But where are we? Maybe up here somewhere. 63 is actually really long. Oh, okay, we were further south. Huh, okay, where's the 9? I don't see it. What the heck? Who cares? Not a problem. Looks Baltic. Time for garbage street view movement. Ay, ay, ay. Well, hopefully Baltic is the right instinct, at the very least. If so, I shouldn't be losing here. Man, this is terrible. Wow, this is really bad. It's worse than usual. Cool, nothing. Let's go Lithuania. Okay, it's solid. Should be good enough. Might be like Estonia, but I don't really care. 
No point in guessing again. I want to keep those three guesses. And it is actually Latvia. I didn't expect that. But okay. That is fine. And what do we have here? I have no idea. Oh, Bhutan. Okay, cool. That makes sense. Classic little stone things, whatever they are. Bhutan loves them, that's for sure. Well, I'm guessing that uh, I'd be shocked if everybody in this lobby knows that this is Bhutan, so I think I can just do this and then chill out for a bit. If this was Battle Royale League, I'd have to be stressing trying to figure out the road or something, but thankfully no issues here. Okay, to be fair, a couple people do have it, but there's no way they all get it. Just gotta wait it out. <clears throat> Distance is like this sometimes. Alright, it was southeast. Fair enough. Four people had it. Four people didn't. Next. Hmm. Left-hand drive, is it? Can't really tell, actually. Okay. Uh, so, Indonesia... I'm not good at Indonesia. Maybe this summer I'll learn the Kabupaten and become a god, but for now... I'm not gonna do that, so... Sick, I don't... I don't recognize a single one of those words, so... Basically, it's guessing time. So I'll go Jakarta. It's already closest. I'll go Sumatra. It's better, but not much better. And I will not guess again. Because <clears throat> I'd like to keep myself at full guesses. And I probably will not be within 100 kilometers here. All right. Oh, wow. Belly tongue. How about that? Yep, totally didn't expect that. Next. Hmm, Chile? Peru? I can't tell if these are yellow lines or white. They are white, so yeah, it should be Chile. And then... Well, somewhere up in the desert. Not sure where. This direction looks boring. Both directions seem fairly boring, to be honest. Yeah, okay, this is, uh... This is not happening. How about there? Oh, no. Okay, how about up here, then? It's a little better. Jesus, it's still not that good. Might be up here, but I should be safe. It was up here. Okay. Close to Bolivia. Fair enough. Yeah, first guess was a little further south than it maybe needed to be. Okay, what's this? Is this Switzerland? Is it low cam? Can't quite tell. Plate looks short. That is surely Swiss, right? Okay, so it's French. So this might tell me something. Yes, it does. Um, let's see, Saint Blaise. Where would that be? Bien Cornu. Oh dear. I, I don't know. Oh, Saint Blaise. Like over here then? Something like that. Yeah, this should be. How did I not see Saint Blaise? Should be close, yeah. 
few people were close, to be fair. But I definitely was closest. Four to go. Don't know. Procopa. Okay, looks Czech, maybe. Or Slovak, or something. That's CZ, okay. Um, hmm. Beyond that, I don't know, and I don't really like this, because I don't want it to be like a prog spam fest or something. I, uh, Vienna, what? I have to guess. I'm going to go prog first, but I don't think it is prog. 2.4 2 kilometers, so let's go like east now, see if my position improves. It actually doesn't, so... Okay, that was dangerous. That was really, really dangerous. I, I That was exactly what I was worried about. Thankfully, thankfully there was that one person who missed it, because I was going to guess here, because I thought that the guesses that were close to me were maybe just a little bit east of me. Turns out they were west. We're very lucky that one person missed that. And now... Rural Ireland. Now, hopefully somebody doesn't figure out that it's Ireland and goes UK. Uh, but I don't see a lot here in terms of info. Though we might get something here. That was... Oh, do I really go look at that? No, those are literally street names. That's much better. Kilkenny R700. Oh, let's just guess Kilkenny first and then improve. Um, R700 here. Okay, I'll go like down there. Just to be safe, right? All right, very good. We did indeed lose somebody to the UK. Final round, what is this, Iceland or something? A little hard to tell, but that's my first thought from what I see, and that is absolutely where we are. And I don't know if that's good or bad. I don't know if this is Reykjavik or not. Oh, dear me. Kind of feels Strato. Is that ever a town? Probably not. I was thinking it could be. Let me see. Like, I'll guess Reykjavik and then see where he goes. I was thinking it could be out near like Keflavik or. Could be anywhere, let's be real. Holy crap. It's not closer, so it's not... Oh, man. I'm going to go, like, Copa Vogor. Uh, I don't have this, folks. GG. That's so stupid. This is why I hate distance, in a nutshell. This is, this is the crap that gets on my nerves. It's like, we're both just randomly guessing. We're not going to figure it out. It's like, what are you supposed to do about that? Oh, that's so dumb. Okay. Yep. This is why, like, almost nobody ends up with, like, 300 points out of 300 on a weekend. Because you always get a distance game that's like that. You always get some random luck thing that screws you over. That's fine. All right, final country game to close out the video. We have the, the uh, Dionysus person, the person who beat me in... Uh, my first game, so hoping to get revenge here. This looks like Croatia with the bollards in the lack of the EU strip on the plates. <clears throat> it's actually Istria, cool. Alrighty. Now we wait. This person, once again, may be my <clears throat> strongest opponent in this game. But yeah, we're just going to have to sit through a lot of 
incorrect guesses here. And yeah, I'm just gonna just gonna hang out until something happens. Do they have black sign backs in Croatia? I did not know that. Uh, anyway. A lot of people struggling here. These two have two guesses left each. One guess left. Why did I say two? Am I good? Ay -ay -ay. I'm out of it right now. Okay. Looks like we may only end up with four people in the second round. Okay, easy UAE by the looks of it. Just like Dubai or something. Maybe it's not Dubai. I don't actually know where it is, but wherever it is, it's definitely in the UAE. And we lose one more. Senegal. Quite simple once again. Interesting, we have water here. Where would we be? Maybe we're on the island here in San Luis, or I don't know. We will never know. I don't know what that is. Uh, I still don't know what this is. Is this, is, oh God, is this Laos? I think it's Laos. Yeah. It's the best I have. Maybe Cambo, but I don't think so. Well, they both went Cambo, and now you went Thailand. Oh boy. Come on, Pele, get it. Oh my god, Dionysus choked. He went Philippines. Totally forgot that Laos existed, it would seem. And finally, Bulgaria, maybe? With the winter? I don't know. I'll go maybe like check next, and if they're both wrong, I'll 50 50. Okay, it's just Bulgaria. Cool. GG's. All right, that was fine. I mean, only thing I lost, well, okay, I lost one country in one distance, but at least I got second in each one. So, I mean, it could be worse. Definitely not my best week, but I think it's a little better than last week. But uh, yeah, I will let you guys know in the comments under a spoiler or something how these final games go. And I'll let you know where my position is in the leaderboard. Uh, not this leaderboard, but that leaderboard. Um, at the end of week five. And I think, what's my maximum here? I'm at 1335 with nine games left. So 1425 is my max. So I would be sitting in fifth place um, overall behind at least one, I think, cheater. I, I don't know who's, who Kiri is, but I think the general consensus is that they are cheating. And uh, Snorlax was actually banned from the leaderboards. There was a whole drama over this. There was like these documents that got released. There was like all this like evidence, all this stuff that was like, oh, Snorlax is cheating, getting him off the leaderboard. And there were like a hundred people who signed a, pe a petition to do it. And um, I ended up being one of them near the end because I sort of finally got con like convinced beyond doubt that he was cheating after some of the some of the initial evidence was uh, not super convincing to me but at the end of the day I decided yeah he, he probably is I'm pretty sure he is cheating and I've been suspe suspicious of him for a long time so <clears throat> anyway enough of, enough on that but that's why he's no longer on the leaderboard and why you've seen him in uh, you know every other season every other every, every other week he's been there that's why he's gone uh, but yeah that'll do it for today's video Thank you all for watching. I will see you in the next one, and peace.